Hi guys, this is Katja with Creators Image Studio. This week I am sharing another batch of 10 Christmas cards with you guys. So here we go again. So these are 10 cards again. And this is a batch with five French sentiment cards because I made these for a friend who has some French friends and they also have five English or Dutch uh, sentiment cards. So this is the first I am using Studio Lights Sweet Winter Season collection, which has lots of pinks, but also some soft blues. So this is the first and this is very pink, as you can see. This entire thing is one uh, die cut or punch out. I lifted it with some dimensional tape and I also did some 3D effects because that is what they offer too. So I punched out some extra Christmas baubles here and accented them with some uh, stickles. And this is a die cut that I did from white paper here as background and the rest is two layers of paper. This is the inside. This is one of their ATC cards, which I also find very handy to write your personal message. And then here another die cut that I did. And this is the back. Here you see another one of their punch outs, sort of an ATC card, comes with its own right, uh, rounded corner. And I stamped this, Goede Feestdagen, so Happy Holidays, and stickled around it here. And did some die cutting of my own, some branches here and here. Added a poinsettia, I think it's by I Am Roses. Die cut a little uh, thingy here to put on top of it and added a bling. This is the inside, again one of their uh, ATC punch outs and again the doily that you saw uh, in the previous cards, but this time in pink. And I uh, used two of their punch outs here to decorate. So pretty simple and yet so lovely. And this is the back. Next card, it says prettige feestdagen, happy holidays. One of their punch outs again, lovely here. And here I did some uh, 3D effect here uh, with their same punch out uh, series and these are all die cuts uh, from uh, from their punch out sheets another i'm roses poinsettia i die cut a little flower here added a bling again this is a button from my stash and then a metal corner oh and this um this label here is not from the collection but uh, this is a printable actually and it comes from my vintage notelet cut apart printable sheet that you can find in my shop. And here is the inside, again with an ATC card here. Look at this lovely pattern that they come in. Added a die cut here and die cut this branch myself. Did some 3D labeling here again. This is also printable from that same vintage notelet sheet that I just mentioned. And I stamped Kerstknuffel, so Christmas hugs and uh, this is the back. Look at this deer here in the background. Lovely paper. Do the next two here. This is another pink one. Beautiful pattern paper. So the paper is white with this whole pattern here. So this is all the pattern. Added some buttons here. Added a poinsettia here. Again with the little thingy and the bling. And this is actually a chipboard frame from my stash. And I painted that in this color and stamped this. Now the trick here is of course you stamp first and then add the frame because you cannot stamp into a frame. Just saying. This is the inside. I left that pretty plain except that I added some uh, glossy accents here to accentuate the happy day that it says. And this is the back. Pretty plain as well but I did add some embossing here with the Christmas, uh, with the snow crystals. And then for one of the softer blue cards that I mentioned, because this paper collection has pinks and blues. Prettige feestdagen, I die cut that sentiment, happy holidays. And these are all die cuts uh, from this uh, collection. And I did add some 3D effects here and there. This is all in the pattern, love it. So I cut two pieces of paper here and added them on top of each other. And this is one of their punch outs. And this is the back. So the blue car blue is lovely as well. So let's move on to the French bulk, also five cards. 
starting with a blue cardigan. Here is one of the chipboard frames again, like the other one that I showed you. I've painted this as well. And this time I didn't stamp, but uh, used a die cut sentiment, Joyeux Noël in French, Merry Christmas, and stickled that, as you can see. This is by Créalis, these sex dies. This is one of Studio Light's beautiful vintage-like, uh, well, pictures that come with this collection and added some die cuts here. Using an ATC card and one of their picture punch-outs, added a bonne année, a happy new year. So yeah, that's the inside and then this is the back. Second French one, again with a little deer here, but this time as part of the paper's pattern and this is what I added. So a lot of die cuts here and again with some 3D effects that I did. This is a stamp that I added myself, Joyeux Noël, Merry Christmas. And this is the inside, again with one of their ATC punch-outs, and I added simply two die cuts, and the back. Back to the pink. This I kept pretty simple, because here are a lot of things going on in the pattern itself, so I didn't have to add much. Added a bow and added a piece of design paper that I first embossed with a wood grain, and then added some wax, some rose gold wax by Prima Marketing. And this is the inside. I didn't do anything at all because this paper is so beautiful, so I left it as is, except adding these two text die cuts, uh, Joyeux Noël and Bonne Année. So Merry Christmas, Happy New Year in French. And this is the beautiful back. So here's another shape. Again, a stamp, Joyeux Noël, and I lifted that with some dimensional tape and added stickles. I added a piece of festive ribbon here and added some die cuts. This is the star of the card, beautiful, beautiful a deer again. Added some buttons here and I die cut a little flower, added a bling, added a metal corner, so beautiful. And this is the inside, only added a flower here with a piece of bling and that's it. So you can write your sentiment here. And then this is the back and I, die, and I embossed that with some great Christmas patterns here that you see. Looks so fun. And then last but not least, this is a little different uh, card. It has a belly band. So let's remove it. Well, let's look at the back first because I added some uh, Joyeux Noël here with some stickles and added a little festive uh, strip here. So removing the belly band so you can open it now. Added a poinsettia here with a brad. This is a die cut and these are also die cuts and this is the pattern of the paper. And here is a die cut as well and I stamped over it. Joyeux Noël, Merry Christmas. And let's open this up and there you go. So simply showcasing the paper and then uh, die cutting two things, this doily here and then this circle here to write your message. So very simple, but lovely, lovely card. I think because of the paper, look at the back. Didn't do anything to it, this is all the paper. Now, as for the belly band, there is a little detail here because I did do some fussy cutting. You see here and here. Just thought that fun. All right, guys, so this was my Studio Light Sweet Winter Season 10 Christmas card set. I hope to have inspired you, this time again with simple uh, designs, but more uh, die cuts and layering. Uh, so uh, I hope you uh, found that great as well. So there are collections that offer these die cuts uh, like Studio Light, but also several other brands. So you can look into that if you do want to decorate, but uh, don't know with what exactly. So these uh, are perfect for that, as you can see. So hope you enjoyed these and found them inspirational enough for you to go create your own. So let me know what you think in the comment section, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you with the next bulk 